Donald Starkel, along with his adventuresome spirit and tireless determination, is a unique and proud addition to the Manitoba Sports Hall of Fame. Born in Winnipeg, Starkel began paddling out of necessity and grew to love it for the freedom. A 1948 flood put him in his family's canoe to get supplies. Two years later, at 17, he was named the most outstanding novice at Kildonan Canoe Club in 1950. By the 60s, he was setting world records. Starkel went on to win numerous provincial and national competitions, in addition to a number of successful long-distance paddling and cycling trips. Tell him he could not do something, and he was driven to prove otherwise, such as his swim across Lake Winnipeg or running the marathon. But Starkel's greatest love in sport has always involved a paddle. He is the author of two books. The first, Paddle to the Amazon, describes his 12,181-mile, 23-month journey from a Red River Bank in Winnipeg to Bellum, Brazil. We just kept paddling on, that boat swooped in on us, and just like I could snap a finger, we'd been pulled out of that boat, and we were in cock tied in cockpits, pulled right out, and we're in the bottom of that fish boat. My son had a pistol at his head. It was a Guinness World Record in 1986 as the longest canoe trip ever. If we had quit, then what we had been trying to do, we would have been the loser. We would have came home and all the rest of our lives, we would have been haunted by the fact that these people had uh, been, they were, would have been, it's like in a, a game, they would have been the victors. In addition to canoeing, Starkel was an exceptional kayaker, which led to his second book. Paddle to the Arctic detailed his 1992 foray across the roof of the world through the historic Northwest Passage when he nearly froze to death in his kayak and lost his fingers and some toes to frostbite. It was the longest self-propelled kayak trip in Canadian Arctic history. Paddler, swimmer, cyclist, runner, kayaker and so much more. Donald Starkel is now a worthy member of the Manitoba Sports Hall of Fame.